Hello guys, excuse the mess behind and welcome to a video. I wanted to do just a week in outfits sort of video. Something really simple um, and yeah, hopefully just a bit of inspiration on the run up to Christmas. Um, it's Sunday today and I am just nipping out and having an easy... Uh, it's Saturday, it's not Sunday at all, but I'm just going to have an easy day even though it's Saturday not Sunday. Um, and this is the kind of outfit you've seen from me before, but um, it's just something I feel really good in at the moment. So I've got my Totem Cream Knit um, on. <laughs> uh, this gorgeous necklace which was sent to me from All Blues that I love. My Totem Trench. My Sophie Hume Bolt bag, just because I wanted to wear my cro a crossbody bag but something shorter. And the Mulberry one isn't as short as this. Weekday Seattle jeans, the dark wash ones. And then my Church's Brogues. And this is just something that I always feel like put together in, effortless, effortlessly stylish in, and it's just sometimes what you need. Today you can go to for an outfit, and that's why like great coats like this where the cut and everything is just so beautiful and do all of the work for an outfit really and make you feel really good with uh, having to have gone to loads and loads of effort. So this is me today. I'm just going to go to Broadway Market to have something to eat. Okay guys, back with another outfit. This section is in collaboration with W Concept. I mentioned in the Japan vlogs I was working with them and I worked with them over the summer and I'm very excited to work with them again. And I've picked out some different pieces online, some more wintry pieces to share with you. The first two are coming in this outfit. These trousers, they are brilliant. They fit so good. They're like a light wool trouser. They're navy blue. It's kind of hard to see here. Let me just open this. We can have the stripes on me for a second. In, in fact, oh, is that better? It's tricky lighting in here. Anyway, you can definitely see there that they are navy blue and they just have the most amazing fit to them. Like they're super, super tight around the waist and then really straight through the leg. Long enough for me to be able to wear. I've just got my Muji trainers and some Uniqlo socks on. And this knit is the Muji one that I bought when I was in Japan as well. It's like a really nice skinny ribbed high neck. It's not really a turtle neck, just a high neck jumper. Um, but yeah, so these trousers are the first thing. And then this amazing jacket that I wore a lot when I was in Japan. Let's shut this again. Um, the brand of the trousers, by the way, is called Schmutt. Of course, they'll be linked in the description box. And the jacket is from a brand called Till. Um, and it's just beautiful. It came with a belt, which I've taken off just because I prefer how a short jacket looks when it's not belted. Um, and again, it's like quite a lightweight wool jacket. It's still pretty warm, though, with all of this amazing detailing on them with the pocket here. I love the neck and how the neck sits. I haven't actually worn it done up yet. I've just been wearing it undone the whole time. And then it's got these big sleeves with the ties on the sleeves it's just such a good jacket I actually wore this exact outfit one day as well before I went away and just loved it I felt so nice in it and yeah the trousers are such good tailoring but uh, the jacket is just beautiful uh, but yeah it's just quite nice wearing a cream jacket in the winter as well it feels like it breaks things up a little bit and I am truly obsessed with this one the belt is just like a nice d-ring belt and it does look nice it's just personal preference I prefer not to have it um, and yeah, I'm just going to take my Sophie Hume bolt bag again just because it's the one that's all packed up. But this is outfit number two. God, having a day where I cannot get dressed. I've gone with Ray Jumper, Muji one underneath, Frankie Shop blazer, the row knit on my shoulders, Totem leggings, Dear Francis boots, and I think I'll just take my... Probably Sophie Hume bolt bag if I'm honest, just because it's still the one that's all packed up and that's how lazy I am. I do like this outfit now, I've settled on it, but this has honestly taken me about 20 minutes and the mess that's ensued behind me to get ready. Oh, good morning guys. Another outfit for you today. I have on the And of the Stories jeans that were in Testing Basics, Uniqlo men's cashmere, a t-shirt underneath a black one, which I think is from Club Monaco. Uh, some black socks from Muji and my Superga gross trainers <laughs> and then a new trench coat which is also from W Concept this is from a brand called Front Row um, and it is a brown trench coat my favourite feature of which are th is the buttons up the cuffs which is so 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 nice like go right up to the elbow and it's also got buttons like that run through the back I'm doing a wonderful job of showing you this 
um, and yeah it's just a nice brown shade which is kind of a bit different it feels very like countryside -y and like I need to go on a nice walk with a dog I don't have and my hunter wellies while wearing this um, but I also really like the big collar on it I think it's really just really nice and it's got these um, darts going down down the boobs <laughs> which is lovely too it's just a really nice cut to it and um, it's not as long as my toe 10 one which is a tiny bit longer which sometimes makes it feel like it overpowers an outfit even more than something like this so it feels like a bit um and like you can wear it a bit more and see the rest of your outfit a bit easier um and yeah i really like it like I said, all of the pieces that I've mentioned will be linked in the description box. They have so many things on W Concept. It can be like overwhelming to shop on there, but there's just so many amazing brands. So um, yeah, hopefully this will be th three pieces I've shown you will be a good starting point for you guys. Um, and yeah, I'm just like running errands today and having a boring day mostly. And like I've said in every single one, I'll probably take my Sophie Hume Bolt bag because it's the bag that's packed up. <laughs> Hello guys, I'm just showing you an outfit I wore last night. I've just got my hair in a bun at this moment of time because I'm just getting ready to go out for the day. So then you'll see another outfit in a second, but I didn't get a chance to show you this before I went out last night. I just went for dinner and to the ballet with Lindsay and wore something smart casual, which is kind of like my go-to look if I was going out somewhere a bit nice. It involved the weekday Seattle jeans, my Dior boots. I was thinking about these last night. I've had these for nearly two years now. The most expensive shoes I've ever bought. They were like nearly a thousand pounds. Um, and they've just been such a good buy. I still love them so bloody much. And they just look, they just look so good. They're so classic and like, I love them. I always feel amazing when I wear them. So all those, Uniqlo cashmere jumper as always. T-shirt underneath. This one's actually Everlane, but I think the one I had on last night was redone maybe. And then my Ray big coat, which I've been finding to be a really good evening piece because of the size of it. It does feel like quite a statement piece to wear. Um, and I've been loving wearing it with in the evening because it just feels really chic. Obviously it's super cold in the evenings at the moment. Um, I just throw this on and it feels so chic and like the outfit's so finished, but still is like the thing I wear every single day, jeans and a jumper, so I'm still comfortable. Um, and I actually took my Dior bag last night, my vintage Dior bag, instead of the Sophie Hume one. But um, yeah, I really like this outfit. And like I said, it's very, very, very much my go-to for just um, anything like that, really. And it's just, I don't know, it's like a testament to having really strong pieces that are so easy to wear, like these Dior boots, that I always feel so good in. And they make my day-to-day -day look just feel way more smart for me because I never wear heels really anymore um, and yeah they really are just some of the best things I've ever bought so this was this outfit now I'm gonna get ready for today and show you what I'm going to wear today okay guys now last outfit I think maybe my favorite outfit of the whole video I've just kept on the cashmere jumper from Uniqlo honestly it's just the best I really should buy it again and have two on rotation that same t-shirt underneath um, this necklace by the way is from Majuri I really like it it's like the perfect thickness of a gold chain I'll link it in the description box uh, a Frankie shop blazer which I bought uh, last year in Paris yeah that's right over a year ago um, I really like it I kind of forget I have it which is stupid because it's beautiful then my army trousers I just love these so 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 much um, in terms of them compared to the W concept ones these are a like the W concept ones are kind of a almost they're more of a woolen fabric but they're not as tailored as these feel so they've just got a bit more movement in them sometimes these are tricky to style because they're very workwear-esque because they're just so straight through the leg and so tailored whereas those W concept ones I think might be a bit easier because they feel a bit more casual um, but I still adore these as well Proenza shoes slowly getting there with them just got some socks on from Muji as well. And then I'm gonna take the Sophie Hume bolt bag. And this is the final look for today, which I really like. These shoes and these trousers are some of my, is one of my favorite combinations. And I think it like adds to the work wear just the right amount, but then takes away from it, makes it a bit cooler as well. I'm aware I'm very much dressed like a boy as well today. Um, and yeah, that's gonna be the final outfit of this. I hope you've enjoyed it. I might make a point of doing these really regularly in the new year when I'm not, whenever I'm not filming or testing basics and um, where I can just show you what I'm wearing throughout the week. Um, 
so let me know if that's something you would enjoy sometimes they can be quite repetitive because they do wear lots of the same things all the time but then I know that lots of you guys find that helpful in terms of how to style things differently as well so um, let me know have a wonderful Christmas I think I've got one more video to go up before Christmas the Japan haul yes I do and then I'll take Christmas as falling on a Wednesday this year I don't know when I'll put them in a video up. There'll be something before the new year, but we shall see. And um, yes, thank you so much for watching. Links for everything in the description box. And I will see you in the next one.